Hey everyone, welcome to Horrible Gaming. My name is Nora and on today's video we are finally touring my finished jungle island. Before we get started though, I'd appreciate if you'd hit that like, subscribe, and notify button if you want to see more content like this in the future. It really does help me out. Here is the dream address and how my map looks in case you want to go check out the island too. This island was basically a little brain cleanser for me before we tackle our next two city core islands. I wanted something relaxing to do, something to get all that terraforming itch out on. So this is what that island resulted in. This island is kind of a recreation in a way of my previous jungle before 2.0 called Moss Deep. If you haven't visited that island yet, I'll definitely leave the uh, dream address in the video's description in case you want to go see it. Uh, it is a lot different from this one just in structure wise and I'm just really excited now that I have two lush simple jungle themes that y'all can go get inspo from. As many know I have a soft spot for tropical themes in general. They're just my favorite to do especially because I just love how the palm trees look. So you're probably going to be seeing me use palm trees on several dream addresses in the future too. I'm not going to say that they're going to be a tropical theme because I just really do like how the uh, palm trees look in general but uh, I do have some really fun city cores planned out I'm feeling very inspired to tackle two of them and you'll know more about these on my next video but uh, I did a really simple little look out of a mini island perspective over here if you want to learn how to build this definitely go check out my other video we do a terraform breakdown on how to accomplish a view just like this once again though i ran out of space on this island that has been my issue lately all of my ideas do not fit on here and this was the reason why i wanted to do a new jungle island because moss deep didn't get all the ideas that i wanted onto it so i wanted to do a bigger abandoned runes area and we still have one on here but it's so small because it's at the edge of my map and uh, i literally just didn't have space for the whole entire idea in my head so uh, that was super, you know, bombing for me. But overall, I feel like I did get a lot of my ideas that Moss Deep didn't get on here, which I'm pretty happy about. I also want to add, if you're new to my channel, I'll quickly introduce myself. My name is Nora and I do a lot of Animal Crossing builds, island tours, and tutorials. I focus on basically every single Animal Crossing island theme, but I do heavily focus on city core islands. I just have a huge soft spot for city core anything. So if you want to stick around and check out my other videos, feel free to, and uh, I hope to see you on my future videos and streams. If you are also wondering what my plans are for Animal Crossing content in the next coming weeks i am planning to redo plus some new ideas every single island that i did before 2.0 if you're not aware of every single island that i have created i will have that video linked in the video's description if you want to go check that out i'm basically improving and recreating a lot of island aesthetics that i've already done and obviously adding ideas that didn't make it onto those so that's what this island was today and again didn't have space for all my ideas but hey i am still very excited about this new remake of the uh, older jungle island so that is kind of like what my plan is obviously we got a lot of great content with 2.0 so i want to make sure that my new revamped islands have that feel there's no way for me to go back to those dream addresses obviously because i delete my island and restart the game every single time i do a new theme so uh, this was obviously a new island. So I didn't want to name it Moss Deep because I didn't want to obviously add confusion. Also want to add before this video ends that my jungle canopy, once again, just like Moss Deep, was inspired by land on Instagram. Same with my entry. So make sure you go check out Mia. I'll have her linked in the video's description. And uh, I did try to keep this island very simple. I am not really a clutter type person when it comes to my natural islands. I really love simplicity and just focusing on my greenery. But I am going to be challenging myself in the future with some cottage core content, especially when I'm getting too burnt out feeling on my city cores and I need a break, just like with the jungle island. So that is definitely planned in the future. And also, I really do want to make a farm core theme too. City core wise, I've been really itching to make a mall themed island, but also with some city core exteriors too. So that is kind of like a snippet of what my plan is. I've been feeling very inspired to do more realistic city builds. I just really enjoy doing those. So I want to add some more 
uh, styles and also improve the older exteriors that we did too on previous themes. So hopefully y'all will be totally excited for that. Then I want to tackle a new Blossom City next. Anyways, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed my completed jungle island. Let me know what you thought about it in the comment section below. And with that being said, thank you so much for watching and have a horrible day. I'll see you next video.